Like Clay County commissioners are talking about Sheriff Daryl Daniels' budget proposal for this upcoming fiscal year. The sheriff is asking for a $10 million increase from the previous year. Tonight on your side's Troy Kless joins us from Clay County, where some commissioners say the $68 million request is a concern. Sheriff Daryl Daniels is asking for what would be the largest budget allotted to the Clay County Sheriff's Office in their history. Now, some people I spoke with feel that the agency needs both the money and the additional manpower. Amanda Kurt has lived in Clay County her entire life and like many has seen how it's changed over the years. The sheriff said in a letter he wants to keep up with that change and Kurt agrees. I think it's a good idea um, because they're going to need more help um, to keep the community not like maintained, but just safe. That's part of the sheriff's plea. The proposed budget includes asking for 61 new full time positions, including almost 30 deputies. County Commissioner Mike Sella called the requested increase unprecedented and a great concern. He says he wants more details on where the money is going. The Sheriff's Office annual report lists that based on population, the county has 47 fewer deputies than the state average. The sheriff hopes they can address their staffing, technology, and recruitment needs. With the county's growth continuing, people like Kurt hope the Sheriff's Office grows with it. How quickly can they get there if the community is, say, all the way out in Lake Asbury? You know, how long is that wait time going to be for them to get there? County Commissioner Mike Sella says that no action will be taken on the budget in tonight's meeting, but they will, of course, review it at a later time. In Clay County, Troy Kless, First Coast News, on your side.